Someone asked me to do the problem on page 153, talking about the Rydberg equation. Uh, Balmer looked at the lines of the hydrogen spectrum, and he expressed the four lines using the equation 1 over lambda, or the wavelength, is equal to 1 over 2 squared, and that's the lowest uh, level of the transition you're going to find in his series. Uh, 1 over n squared, where n is always going to be greater than 2. And the equation to the right of this equation in your book was determined using this uh, expression here, which should be memorized. The Rydberg constant has been determined to a lot more than four significant figures, but for our case, it is 1.097 times 10 to the minus second reciprocal nanometers. Okay, for our problem, we're looking at the specific case where n is going to equal to 3. And so, you plug that into the Rydberg equation, where 1 over lambda is equal to Rydberg constant, times 1 over 2 squared, times 1 over 3 squared. 1 over 2 squared is just 4. 3 squared is 9. And the way I solved this is I worked it out step by step. 1 over 4 is 0.25, 0. 1 over 9, if you plug that into your calculator, you're going to find it to be 0. 0.111. When you subtract these two numbers, you, you will find you will get 0. 0.139. Multiply that number times the, the Rydberg constant. 1.097 times 10 to the minus 2 reciprocal nanometers, and you will get 1.524 times 10 to the minus 3rd reciprocal nanometers. That's one of the answers they get in the, on the page for the problem. Then they find the wavelength, which is the reciprocal of 1 over lambda. So 1 over 1 over lambda is just lambda. 1 over 1.524 times 10 to the minus third reciprocal nanometers. You will have to plug that into your calculator. You obtain 656.3 nanometers. And that solves your problem.